guys i hope you are doing great now give me a thumbs up if you like house plants well i do because i truly believe that house plants help to eliminate dangerous chemicals from the air in our homes yeah we know that there are studies by nasa that um, tells us that house plants some house plants um, actually help to eliminate um, dangerous chemicals from the air in our homes such as um, formaldehyde and uh, carbon monoxide so i grew up with this house plant in jamaica and the way we use to propagate the plant is cutting um, pieces of the main plant and putting them in water for them to root so there's a lovely plant our subject of this lesson is the potos plant now we don't call it potos in jamaica we call it creeper a lot of times we'd find it outside actually um in the garden and it would be creeping on the ground or up trees and so creeper right but in patwa jamaican dialect we call it creeper so not creeper but creeper anyways <laughs> that's just a little side note so um i have some jars here with water because as i said we are going to be putting the pieces in water and leave them to root now i started one here a few weeks ago and you can see that it's rooting here so one of the things you have to be sure of is that when you put it in the water you check back often just to make sure that this area here that it's rooting from is always below the water i have this in water and you can see that right here there is a little root that is starting however what you should do is snip the leaf off don't put the leaf below the water because it's gonna get the water all murky and so you want to snip the leaf off you want to make sure that the part of the slip that's going into the water has one of these joints and then has a another joint up here at least a joint if if it doesn't have a leaf i've never had a problem with it um growing roots i've heard it suggested that if it doesn't have a leaf you should not use the piece of vine but i've never seen where it hasn't gotten roots and so i'm gonna use the piece of vine whether or not it has leaves on it because what usually happens is not, not only does the root grow from the join here but the leaf also grows from the join here so i'll take this one back and show you something now that when i put this in the water it had this leaf and you can see another leaf has come up right here so i'll go ahead and i'll cut these up and put them in the jars okay so i have water in all the jars already and i think i need a little more water in this within a couple of weeks actually you should see some sign of rooting happening I have a long old piece here without any leaf but I'll go to this end and I'll deal with this end and then I'll go back to that end so I have a leaf here I have a joint here I'm gonna snip off this leaf and then I'm just gonna snip the vine right here and I'm gonna put this in the water I'm gonna put a little more water in actually you could grow this creeper in this jar as long as you want 
you don't have to put it in so unnecessarily because i remember growing up in jamaica what we would do is we'd have the creeper in the water we'd get some little pet fish and we take the fish home and put the fish in the jars and the fish would literally feed off whatever moss or whatever was growing on the root of the creeper so let's just finish up i have a leaf and i'm gonna cut it down here because it has a big swollen nodule right there looks like a root is getting ready to pop and then i'm gonna put this in you don't have to put them in different different jars either you can put two or three in a jar and then i'm back to the piece without leaves i'm gonna put them in the jars so i have um a join here another join here pretty close and then there is another one up here so what I'm gonna do is cut it above here and then I'm gonna stick this in the jar so I actually have two joints below the water if one doesn't root the other will and a join a join join okay so i don't want to cut this in three so i'm just going to cut this what's left in two and stick this in i'm going to stick this in now i'll give you guys an update especially on the ones the especially on the pieces of vine that don't have leaves I don't see why they should not root and so I'm not gonna throw them out I'm gonna use them if you have learned something from this video if you enjoyed watching the video please leave your comment below thank you so much for liking sharing and yeah for subscribing now if you have watched this video and you have not subscribed please consider subscribing don't miss out remember also when you subscribe to hit that notification bell icon so you can be notified of new videos you take care now i'll see you in the next video